Hi guys, welcome to my channel and welcome to Mystical Mondays. Uh, for those of you guys who don't know me, my name is Lena, and uh, here on Mondays on my channel, I talk about dreams and mystical experiences. Uh, and then the rest of the time that I post, I talk about my experiences overcoming anxiety and depression. I talk about mindset and manifesting and awareness and awakening uh, for now. So today I want to talk about uh, waking up to seeing like patterns on the wall, almost as if you were in uh, another dimension. So uh, if you're interested, uh, stick around, we'll get into that. But in the meantime, uh, I appreciate it if, uh, if you'd give this video a thumbs up if you feel inclined to do so and then hit the subscribe button uh, which would really help out my channel and then if you want to be notified anytime I upload new videos then just hit the bell notification beside the subscribe button and uh, again I would really appreciate that okay so this particular dream I had back in November of 2019 and uh, it was the first time I had ever experienced anything like this I, um, I had been asleep I don't remember if I had had a dream or not uh, if I did then uh, it'll be in my notes and I'll talk about it at some point but when I wrote uh, about this particular experience I didn't um, mentioned that I had ha had any dreams prior to this so and again if I look down it's because I've taken all of my dreams from my uh, from my notepad and uh, I've written them or I've retyped them into Word on my laptop because I also create blog posts uh, on Mondays so Mondays is also mystical Mondays on my blog Okay, so I bought a ring light and it's now showing up behind me uh, and it's bothering me a little bit. So I meant to change it, I actually turned it to the side. So I will fix that in the next video if it happens to bug any of you guys. Uh, but luckily I have a better lighting situation here in my office than um, I did prior. Uh, so. I'll fix the ring light issue and totally won't have to bob and weave anymore. <laughs> okay, so this uh, this particular night uh, I had been asleep and then when I first woke up and opened my eyes, my bedroom walls were completely covered in like a black and white floral design, like completely covered everywhere the walls, the ceilings, uh, everything. Uh, so I struggled a bit at first because uh, at first I wasn't sure uh, if I was like in a different um, point in time and then like coming back to the present. So as if I was in a parallel reality and I was um, coming back to the present as I was waking up. Um, even though I was lying in bed, uh, let's see. Oh, I made a note. So I actually do remember seeing a similar pattern. Like in, uh, I had been, I had watched a show of like fixer upper and this particular pattern that I saw as I was waking up, like all over my walls and ceiling was similar to a pattern if I, that I had seen in, uh, the TV show. So at first I was like, you know, maybe my sub the pattern was just suppressed on my subconscious. Maybe I was in like a parallel reality. And again, I was coming, as I was waking up, I was coming back to this present reality. Uh, I don't know for sure. Uh, let's see. Uh, so I wrote in here in my notes uh, that Neville Goddard, and for those of you guys who don't know, I have been studying Neville Goddard for almost a year now. Uh, he just really resonates with me. Uh, he talked about his experiences, like coming back 
uh, from the dream state uh, or rather other dimensions, um, you know, uh, parallel realities, so different points uh, in time, the spiritual world or, you know, in awareness, however you want to define it, whatever you're comfortable with. Um, so then my next thought was that the pattern um, was just uh, like tangible evidence uh, through like a visual experience uh, of me coming back like into this physical uh, garment of flesh after being uh, after being somewhere else. So I know it probably sounds a bit out there, uh, but given all the experiences and dreams that I've had lately, uh, I really honestly anymore don't find anything like truly out of the ordinary. I know dreams are full of uh, symbolism. So I just, I write them down and then, you know, if a thought comes to me about what a particular dream can mean, then, you know, I write that in my notes. Now this is not, so this is the first of two experiences I've had like this, maybe three, uh, but I haven't. So all these tabs are uh, dreams that I still have to uh, to rewrite or to type up in Word, but I've got a bunch of them. I've already typed out like 20 of them, uh, and this is only one notebook. So I may have had more than two dreams uh, where I've saw I've seen these patterns, but this was the first one. So anyway, yeah. If you, any of you guys have uh, had any experiences like that uh, and want to leave a comment. Uh, kind of engage in conversation, share your experiences. Uh, I would, would love that. Uh, but for now, I am going to sign off of this video and I will see you guys in the next one. All right, have a great day.